requested by bro bomb <laughs> I'm Falco. I'm Pongo. I'm Yoctavian. Oh, and just to clarify, my name is spelled like this. And I'm Knuckles. And together we are... The Logo, Logo History, History Game. Hey, it looks like that was the fifth episode of the series. We're going to be taking a look at Columbia Pictures. Oh. Huh? Let's take a look at the short bio. For those of you who don't know what Columbia Pictures is, it is an American film studio that was founded on January 10th, 1924 in Los Angeles, California by Harry Kahn, Jack Kahn, and Joe Brandt. Their headquarters are in Culver City, California. Its key person is Tom Barry Jr. President. And now, without further ado, let's get started. Go, oh, go, oh, go, oh, come on, let me go to the next one. Here we go. From 1924 to 1925, um, <laughs> um, so, um, there is the, uh, there is this, uh, there is the lady for the Columbia Pictures logo, except that she's not holding a torch. Like, in, the, in this one, she's not holding a torch. I have no idea what she's holding. She's like holding like a shield or something. I, I have no idea. Um, and she's inside this um, white sheet with like black and white outline or something like that. And um, in front of her, there are the words Columbia Pictures Corporation stacked together and in black text. Except that the word corporation is smaller than the words Columbia Pictures. And below the word corporation, there are two black lines. 1925 to 1926, uh, we have the torch lady holding a shield. Uh, we might as well call her the shield lady until the torch shows up, which should be in the next logo. Um, and the lady is inside this um, black circle. And uh, also holding, also inside the shield are the letters CP in um, black text. Above the circle, there's the word Columbia in yellow, I mean, I mean, not yellow text, damn it. Uh, it's in black text, Columbia. And then below the circle, we have the word pictures in black text. 926 to 1932, the torch is born. Da -da! Sorry, I got too excited. Oh, God. All right, so, so we have the torch lady and and she's holding a torch that looks like a light bulb. And the torch has the letter CP inside of it. And in front of the torch lady, there's a white banner with the word Sims of the screen in black text. And there's also another circle surrounding the circle that the torch lady is in. And inside that circle, there are the words Columbia Pictures in, yeah, in white text. 1932 to 1933? She's kind of naked, I guess. I guess you can probably tell, but yeah. Um, and she's inside this orange background with flowers behind the torch lady. And um, she, and, and this background is also inside this um white circle with blue outline. Inside that circle, there are the words Columbia Pictures and orange text with stars in between them. Huh? 1933 to 1936. This is pretty much the same thing as the previous logo, but it's like black and white. 1936 to 1993, nothing to write home about, it's just the torch lady. 1936 to 1938, there is the touch, I mean torch lady, and she's inside this like bush-like background, I guess, I don't know. I, is, is that a mountain behind her? I really don't freaking know. Um, and in the center of that background, there's the torch lady, like like I said before. And um, above her, there is the word Columbia in white text with black outline. And below her, there is a white rectangle 
with the word pictures in white text with black outline inside of that. 1938 to 1945, there's the torch lady herself with rays coming out of her, and there's also a white circle surrounding that circle, and inside that second circle, there are the words Columbia Pictures in black text. Yeah, see that? Yeah. 1945 to 1964, there's the torch lady, you know, from the 1930s one? Hold on, let me go back a few slides. Oh, yeah, in the 1936 one, same as the 1936 one, except that there's like a banner in front of her. Hold on, why can't I move back to the side it was before? Okay, there it is. Uh, it's the same thing as the 1933 one, and in front of her, there's a banner with the words Columbia Pictures in uh, black text. Oh! 1964 to 1975, the torch lady is gone! <laughs> She's gonna be back eventually. Um, so there's the letter C in white text with black outline, and in and in, inside, like, like stabbing, uh, how do I say this? Stabbing the circle is the torch. Um, and all these things are inside this, uh, black rectangle, I guess. 1975 to 1981, this is probably among Columbia Pictures' most popular logos. Um, so there is a semicircle, not a cylinder, Robert. I know, in the first episode of Logo History, you know, the original Logo History series, I said, like, Cylinder instead of semicircle. I don't know why I said that, but back to you, Pongo. So there's a semicircle, not a cylinder, and inside that semicircle, there is a white sun. And below that, there are the words Columbia Pictures stacked together and in black text. 1981 to 1989, the Torch Lady is back. Hooray! 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 Yeah, the whole gang is happy that the torch lady's back. Okay, so there's the torch lady, and uh, there, and she's inside this um, black sheep with a sun in the back of her. And below that sheep, there are the words Columbia Pictures in black text. 1989 to 1993, pretty much the same thing as the previous logo, but the torch lady and the sun are out of the black sheep, and the font for the words Columbia Pictures changed. <laughs> to the present, there are the words Columbia Pictures in black text, and they're both stacked together. And next to these words, there is a black square with the torch lady inside of it, and in the back of the torch lady, uh, there are clouds. Uh -huh. Alright, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, we have reached the end of this episode. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And don't forget to request a logo for the next episode, guys. Also, be sure to like this video, smash that like button, share this one with your friends, and leave a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe with notifications turned on so you don't miss another video from this channel as Rob Geo 407 is on a road to 5k subs. It would be much appreciated to subscribe to him because we're only halfway there to 5k thank you for watching and we will see you all in the next episode bye for now bye for now bye for now bye for now bye for now, bye for now. Oh.